Welcome back to A Night in Roxburgh. Uh, we are now about to enter Tunnel 1, and hopefully this time I will make it onto this ladder without falling to my death. I see why there's a pile of blood at the bottom, because obviously someone's fallen down here before, and you know what? Not the first time Garrett's fallen to his death off a ladder recently. Is the cutscenes anything to go by? Hello? Spice smugglers? Reaching, uh... Coming to an unfortunate end. Moss arrow? Why is moss growing in full water? Hello? Shall we? Fact. Checking out the water is going to give us potential to spy what's ahead, but hopefully without being seen as easily, I guess. I got spooky sounds, but they do seem to be atmospheric only. Um, I didn't hear what that said. That's just my imagination, there's nothing here. Why would there be anything here? Probably just imagination. It's coming from this way, was it not? Hello? You look like a keeper. Give me like that, dude. These slant edges are really bad because you can't like climb up them properly or, or anything. Thing not to do, don't make slightly slanted edges, make them very low yeah. slope. <laughs> very low slopes. Be careful. I found the corpse. This is all your fault. You better explain yourself, friends. No, 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 no. Just wait a minute here. 
I got nothing to do with this. We're doing our rounds. <laughs> yep. Uh, let us. What was it saying? Yeah, pull, pull the vertical edges of all low slopes. You can do like 45 degrees, but you be careful. Be careful. I found a corpse. It's all your fault. Dr. K, I know it's a very long time since you made this mission. Be careful. Be careful. I found a corpse. It's all your fault. But uh, this is not good. Lada. Well, let's just see if I can climb straight off the ladder. Careful. Be careful. I found a corpse. This is all your fault. You better explain yourself, rats. No, 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 no. Just wait a minute here. I got nothing to do with this. We were doing our rounds. There was no trouble. But suddenly we heard a noise behind us. So I went to have a look. Well, there was nothing. I looked, what, less than two minutes and... <laughs> I turned back. He had disappeared without making a noise or leaving a trace. So then, at first I thought he went ahead without waiting for me. But after 15 minutes of searching, I still couldn't find him. Then, then I heard this horrible scream. It uh, sounded like a bird's, but there was something monstrous in the sound of the voice. So I took to my heels, and when I got there, I found him just like that. I tell you, it was not a pretty sight. He's already committed murder. I've seen another just like it with a hole in it. No, a simple killer could not have done that. I'm sure it's the beast, the Roxburgh beast. It, it really exists. Who oh, really? And me, the woodsy lord. Valets, you're already on the path as it is, and on some of that, I'm gonna have to put up with an idiot, stinking corpses, and a killer. Oh, no. Stand your positions and keep your eyes open. I'm going to kiss a report. Something there? Mm, what the hell was that? Stop! Really in the name of the law! Got enough of your thing! It's not fair, guys. I was hidden, and you just walk up. All right. Well. Sigh. So I wonder if the zombie keeper is the, is the one we need to be careful to cover. I found a corpse. This is all your fault. You better explain yourself, rats. No, 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 no. Just wait a minute. I got nothing to do with this. We were doing our rounds. There was no trouble. But suddenly we heard a noise behind us, so I went to have a Notice to the City Watch. We can't afford to take any more risks. The situation is stable, but just barely. Until a solution is found, a formal order is in place. Eliminate anyone found in the Red Quarter, excluding Hammerites, the Villas children, and your own watch members, of course. However, if you believe someone is contaminated, first seek out a Hammerite priest or a Mechanist Great Sister. Sheriff T. Look, well, there was nothing. I looked, what, in less than two minutes, and... I turned back. He had disappeared without making a noise, nor leaving a trace. So then, at first I thought he went ahead without waiting for me. But after 15 minutes of searching, I still couldn't find him. Then, then I heard this horrible scream. It uh, sounded like a bird's, but there was something monstrous in the sound of the voice. Okay, so where are we? Kind of on the northern end of the red quarter, I guess. Right, we're right here. This this is the zigzag down. Hmm. Okay, I should I should explore this end first, I think, before heading towards the question marks. Are you gonna 
You don't just stand right there, are you? Alright, keep patrolling. So, those people with the lights have got to be coming back, right? They come here, there's no... This is a dead end. Where do they go? Do you have one of those helmets? I think you do. Blackjack proof ones. It's not so cool. street does go through here, okay. So it's not fully sealed off. Hang on a second, is it not? Got a purse on you. I'm interested in that. Oops, here comes the lights. I'm not so interested in those, so I guess. I guess I'm gonna try and wait for them to go by. Alright, so am I supposed to see what I'm doing? So looking here for we are in the red quarter now, so I guess we need to find that red soul or whatever, hello. Speaking of red. It's a note that I can't read. There's a ladder in that fireplace. That's a stay away from some other room, I guess. Well, let's burn another one of these. Nice view. Keeper? Are you alright? Well, you're not hostile, so... Cool. I... I'm here, cats, but I can see a spider. One more. <laughs> okay. It's a wee one. They're not as bad as the big ones. Another rope arrow. Although it feels like it might be 
concealing something or just stack up, you know, nice in the corner, who knows. Ah, uh, seems like they're just stacked up nice in the corner. Is that wood? That looks like metal, but the rest of it's wood, right? Okay, this will get me to the other side of the starting area. Let's try this. Nothing. Guys, got well, I can knock him out. I don't have an unknockable helmet, but seems to be no reason to, right? So maybe there's actually no reason even to be here. No doors. Too far away to reach, isn't it? If he's coming, that's good. That may give me an opportunity to get past him. Well, he's not actually coming. Go then, you go there. Oh, he's coming. Okay, good. Come into the dark area, mate. It's, it's much nicer here. from him. This did not go the way I wanted. <sighs> well, you know, it is, it is a danger zone. You know, it could have been an undead attack team. He's about to come back as a zombie and bite you all. You, you're not really following security protocols. You need to execute and cremate him ASAP. Well, now, now they are just searching again. Still thirteen. You don't really think he's still hiding there? What if a miscreant did the deed? Oh shit! Maybe he did. Did not come here. Yeah. Going down. 
Yes, I'm afraid of. Out of my way! Yeah, you got me. Fair enough. Okay, well, there was no point putting my rope there, so let's not <laughs> repeat that exercise. Here's why I said before doing it. Hello, I didn't check up on these beams there, did I? Anything? No. So I was giving him a ladder, but I was falling. It's fine. I didn't suffer any damage. Okay. So that's the steps down to the road place. There's a fortress there, there's the Marche Noir there. I guess we're going that way soon. Piles of bodies. Oh, there's a guard at the fortress. Sweet pings indeed. Wait for the other lamp guard to go as well. So hard to get any sense of which areas are well lit and which ones aren't. I'm like constantly surprised by brightness, but that's that's very common in oh cells. How? I was in the dark. Wasn't I? Apparently he's hot on my tail. Luckily, this particular uh, drain was uh, deeper than the others, but I can't get out here, so... I have no idea who those people were, how they saw me. Yeah, 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 whatever. <laughs> oh, this might be another part of the same tunnels. What? Could you try and be a little more? You didn't see me there, did you, mate? Apparently, you did. So again, I'm getting discovered far more easily than I would think, but. Uh... So I can't hear what he's doing. Ah. 
There were two of them. Vegetarian. What a crime. It's a toad. It's a weed. Why can I make it up there? Oh shit. Everybody's on my tail. Everybody's on my case. I have no way to run and hide. That's my only way out of here. Well. It's two of my only ways out of here. Step out here. I won't hurt you. Hmm. Well, I think I'm gonna keep doing blackjack sprees because I have no idea how else I'm gonna manage this. Make it easy on yourself and surrender now. This is not. Still set. Step out here. I won't hurt you. You know what? Great. Trying to avoid that, but fine. Where can to wait till they give up and stop searching for me. But I think they heard the splash and are, and are angry again, so... Everybody's angry. I shall find thee. Safe enough to wait here, right? Yeah, the end of the corridor would have been about it, yeah. Brother Altard. I think it's dark enough to have it not be seen, but who knows. You know what, just in case. Bring you to that corner where you'll definitely not be seen. Now we wait for... Sister... Melina. Okay. I think they're the two I have to worry about who are patrolling this place. Okay, what's up with this door, Blaze? Wasn't expecting that. Um, am I supposed to know what to do here? Oh, it's a portal. Wait a minute. This is the Silent Hill world. Message to all souls. 
Following the incidents observed in Roxburgh, and for concerns about the immediate risks created by these events, the corridors to the North Star and to the Builders Cathedral have been closed. Please report any activity. Protective Soul Fergus. Sommes-nous maîtres de nos écrits, ou devenons-nous les esclaves de nos lectures Il faudra que j'en parle à la Nima. Soul Sath, for what dark reasons have you claimed the right to keep the only key of the archives? Indeed, your selfish insistence prevents my access to the statue of the late interpreter Nathaniel, which, I remind you, was shattered by your own attack glyph five times ago. Furthermore, that violence baffles me still. How can a statue move and act freely, even so far as to display the gift of speech? Interpreter Tassel demanded that I repair the statue. At the time of my errand, I will ask you to surrender the key into my hands. Regards, in advance, Soul Tenethor. Are you the guy with the key to the archives or are you the guy writing a letter? <coughs> Guess you were writing a letter. Well, I'm gonna do a, a hard take here because this is somewhere new with unknown dangers and not much in the way of escape routes. So I could easily get a bad quick save, so that would be hard to. Ah, oui, en ce lieu? Pas de temps à perdre avec ce genre de futilité. There must be someone downstairs. We should sound like they're upstairs and we're invisible. I need to be with these guys. Better. This is keeper territory. I've had enough keeper bullshit. But I will see what monies they have. See what information I can find out. Message to all souls. Due to anomalies in past times, any soul utilizing the archives must register its name on the list beneath. Soul Sath, Soul Akram, Soul Lima, Soul Dikra, Soul Akram. Entry 6. Blank. He's going to like the keepers, but the French. Is this the archives? I guess it is.
Well, they're not just French, they also speak in reverse. <laughs> Study of dead zones. What do we mean by a dead zone? In agreement with numerous existing theories, we admit that it is a zone cut out from material reality, but a place of which access is still possible. A dead zone may be revealed by a shadow existing absurdly and illogically in the centre of some radiance. Whether the light is artificial or natural is irrelevant, for a dead zone is a shadow of nothing. Among the various treatises, none have ever explained dead zones in a convincing or even rational manner. Probably influenced by the religious orders of the city, who see these zones as manifestations of the trickster. Nevertheless, all agree that dead zones may only be found in Roxburgh, which forms our theory. The rest of the book is written in incomprehensible glyphs. We know he does actually come out here. I read that one, right? Yes. Superior Sol Duma, we write to inform you of our concerns. Since many times ago we have observed abnormal occurrences in the laboratory, occurrences that, according to Sol Dikra, have also been seen within the North Star. Indeed, several of us have noticed the disappearance of some books, particularly those supposedly protected in the archive rooms. Our concern is that such events cannot be the result of some careless mistake. Is this the act of an outside entity, or perhaps a consequence of the glyph of oblivion being cast accidentally by Sol Edris? Two times before the rebirth of Sol 8? Most certainly this glyph could only have influenced our minds, and not the physical world. But according to the writings of Sol South, our connections with the books may be so vigorous that our thoughts expect their very existence, so that oblivion would cause their disappearance in an irreparable manner. Irreparable because it is impossible to remember all the symbols of the book, thus preventing replication from memory alone. We suggest that you commence an investigation of the matter. These kinds of incidents could cause grave losses of prophecies, among others. Sol Tenethor and Sol Lima. Well, I want to check that desk, but I want to wait until this guy's not going to see me at it. <laughs> Why did I hear horn noises there? That was... <laughs> Is it one of the superior souls? Downstairs. Maybe I'll stop in for a little light reading. That's them there, and they're pretty fast.
God. It's pretty busy down there. I'm going to knock them out and, and make a mess. Message to Detective Solfergus. I disapprove of the methods used during interrogation. In the present case, the Keeper did not survive. How can I probe a corpse's mind? Only three of us have mastered the glyph of dead reading, and they are all at the North Star, where their abilities are useless to me. I must know more about the unexpected and scheming presence of these Keepers. Besides the death of the first, you did not permit the opportunity to study the second. I hope your refusal to learn more subtle methods of persuasion does not leave us blind and vulnerable. I need to know what is your purpose or your intention on this issue. Soul sound. Oh, there's someone else there at the desk, too. Where's the same guy? Archives key, huh? No, it's a different guy. Yeah, this guy's was standing up. He doesn't have anything of interest to me, right? I've read that already. I think. Sol Akim, know that your irresponsibility and negligence will remain unforgiven. And that Protective Soul Fergus is furious about your loss of the prophetic book on the Dawn of Darkness. Sooner, or later if you're fortunate, you must suffer its wrath. Expect the consequences of your folly to be no less than severe. Also, please deal with the remains of the Keeper. Of course, to do so you must inquire the access methods from Soul Fergus. Only it knows the switches that unlock the basement door. Do not ask me the reason for all these protections. I fail to grasp the rationale myself, since an intrusion into the laboratory is certainly unthinkable. If you do not wish to end like Sol Sodomia, hasten to your task, Solima. <coughs> feel like... I will be better served by making sure none of these guys are conscious. <coughs> Sol South, oh, I've been reading a lot of... Stuff about you. Of course, you had to keep the archives. Yeah, I can't quite get around there. Just, uh, in just in terms of, yeah, you could go to this place, but didn't see me, did you? the red thing I need. That's what I came here for. Oh, 
Så han behövde sova på det här på handet. What I actually came here to get. Fergus, you're gonna be a nuisance, aren't you? With your glowy hands. Okay, they go out. In that in that position anyway. There's this one guy here. So deep, bro. He stops <laughs> reciting his, his chant. This, oh no, got it wrong. So, Acro Acrimonious. All right. I mean, it's definitely gonna be easier for the keepers to come and clean all these guys up, right? Because they're all unconscious. That's what I'm telling myself. Salt in a thorn. Alright. Is this what came in? Yes. So there's a bunch more teleports out there, which is interesting. Okay, so I can't hear any more people around. I think we're clear. For the time being. Let's see what's happening in the archives. Well. Gas arrow. Water arrow. Fire arrow. Healing potion. Holy water. Speed potion. Invisibility. Valuables. These are good archives, yeah. These are bad locks. <laughs> this is the lock picking song. I sing it all day long because that's how long it takes. The only thing left for me to do is to make my exit. Uh, no, Garrett. You have a lot more to do than that. Look. Look. Six more checkpoints. But, uh, that's tunnel. Tunnel 13 key, was it? Yeah, so Tunnel 13 must be the one out of the end, right? You know what? Oh, that's just a broken statue, that's no use. And the other one of those doesn't open. 
Okay. Well, I wouldn't want anyone to think somebody broke in here, right? Hey, dude. Where's the stairway? I don't know how I'm supposed to get in there and get the thing. Let's get back up this up the stairs and throw one of the old teleports, maybe? I don't know. Got a key, got a bunch of notes about these guys. Knock them all out, but it doesn't really let me know what's going on. It doesn't really give me a clear indication. Thanks, Garrett. So that's the one I came in, right? Or was it that one? It was that one. Let's see where this one takes us. Do we, is it two way or is it one way? God, we're all the way back here. It seems to be one way. Um, how am I supposed to get down without dying? Hello? I don't want to be here. Die, but it did cost me health and definitely gonna cost me time. I have some food anyway, right? Wow, these apples are not very nutritious. There we are. went through the water here to search it. You're not, you're not the injured keeper, right? I mean, you could be, I don't know. I don't know how I'm supposed to tell. I can't attack you. This guy I wanted to knock out anyway, so... Sergeant Pascal? I would like to make the streets safe for, uh... Miscreants such as me. Alien, you can stay here with Sergeant Pascal. This. This. This what? Brother Kamali, you didn't finish your sentence. You should finish sentences, yeah. I'm a little concerned about those. 
lamp guards because they wander around shine things, you know? So you illuminate subjects I'd rather than have left dark. I'm cleaning up because it'll get me running around the streets and finding what the hell I need to find much more easily. I know it's, it's kind of cheesy. It's all guards with lanterns that can discover things. ones. With their brightly lit appendages. You're just watching bodies burning, great sister? I don't think you're so great. If that's what you're doing. Does bodies even have any loot on them? You know, it's... Hmm. It smells a bit. Hello. Alright. Francis, this street should be cleaner now. I mean, given that I've got everybody in the other parts of the streets alerted to me, the main reason I'm cleaning up is that Again. Okay. But the doors do not open. Seems like there's nothing here. We're back at Red Square. I mean, it is quite red. Okay, so this is where I got seen somehow before. Hey, who are you? Guards, over here! I see, that's how I got seen. All of a sudden, walking through a patch of shadow, I get lit. Hey! Come on now! I won't hurt you. Someone other than us is poking around, around here. here. Problem solved, Jacob. There. Here. Right, so I'm trying to stay in the shadows and you get seen right in front of somebody. That's how I got seen before. Good work making nice shadow patterns on the ground and not actual shadows. 
You know what? I'm gonna get you guys out of this. Dark places on these streets are surprisingly brightly lit. <laughs> Just looking for a nice place to pack a body, and now you have to have everything brightly lit. I should have left me in the series after all. <laughs> you should really, like, kind of get in the way. Right, so this is the way I came, right? This is where the glyph... That's where the glyph door is, yeah. At least one other reprobate. Repro rep reprobating down here. Baiting me into repro repercussions. That's the one. I definitely had repercussions before. What is this place? I mean... Is this a weird underground market or what? I suppose... I mean, it could just be thieves... A thieves market, I suppose. <laughs> Even it does seem to be mostly... Using people like that here. Alright, nothing here. Water arrows, fire arrows, another rope arrows, noisemakers, a lot of broad hats. Some moss. Wow, a lot of equipment when oh, it's really too late. Gas mine, a mine, a flash bomb, more water arrows, holy water, a healing potion, and a sword. So I was gonna have to take the one off the wall. Alright, so, uh. That's good, that's a lot of good stuff. One more objective to ticked off. So, I found the soul harp. I don't know how to do it. One or two keepers are still alive. Find him and bring him back to Estovia's. Okay, no idea where. Almost dead, find his corpse. Yep. I guess I'm hearing people up above me, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> right up there. So I've got two questions in my head now. One is... Where's the other teleporter go? <laughs> this is the servant Muriel, important. The Builder's children discovered a fraud concerning the armor of Black Market in the Red Quarter. You don't need to know the details, but I'll tell you that this Jacob may have found a way to improve the Hammerite's holy water. The Builder's children have forced him to continue his research, so I think there should be some of their members down there. But your men will have to keep a watch on the entrances to Black Market to ensure that no one escapes. 
Sheriff T. Sergeant Muriel, you are in dereliction of your duty. children <laughs> ah that looks like our dead keep a friend keep a rummy wait are you still alive you're the one that's still alive right I think I hit Sergeant Muriel's body quite well, because... You're gonna go join them. Brianna. Hmm. A little too visible there. Probably okay. Is this even the way I need to be going? This may not connect with anywhere. Where am I? Uh, at the west northwestern corner? That doesn't make any sense. I guess we're off the map. That's the black market there. Is taking me. I have a foggiest idea. Just place, right? You don't look like a religious type. Ooh. Bitch. Now tell me, which one are you?
Manuel, you seem unwell. You and Vitch can hide there. Okay, so let me keep come back out this way. So that's just watching Red Square. Is there anything else out here? Fire in a barrel. There's a canal. me like a spider. Damn it. Ah, uh, it's geometry. Stuck in it. Like that little spider. Break it down. Can't lock pick it. It's not gonna be a key, of course. Yeah, I can't lock pick it. Well, good thing it's a nice solid door then. Maybe it was this. Oh, this is a zombie I was hearing behind the door, I guess. This way. Right. This is good. That was actually excellent. Brother Phoebus, let us remove you from the zone of possible harm. 22 water arrows. Just spend two of those in one mine. You just put the fire out or blow the thing to pieces, you know? Which I want to do. Always explosions. Alright. 
Thanks so much for the Builder's Children of Karis, or whatever you call these robot things. Okay, so what am I trying to do? The Soul Heart. I need to get the Soul Heart. Ah, yes. Where did I leave? Where did I leave our, our keeper friend? Was it out here? No. I've gone where? Here we are. Keep around me. Let's get you back to Red Square. For starters. Although... What's down this way? So this is the back end, which is the fortress. Well, I'm... This is the dead end, isn't it? Fortress takes us to Red Square, yes. Uh, what I'm realizing is that uh, the black market to the north, uh, to the east, where is east? To the right. I'm wondering if maybe the best way to actually get you back to the inn is through these tunnels. Right? I mean, I don't know where the other teleporter goes. It could be going in a very bad way. Is that still open? No, it closed itself. Book now. Oh, you know what? So much for your banners. Okay, so that one went to the street at the start. Where does this one take me? Oh. Uh huh. Alec with the spiders. the ladder here. There. It's basically invisible. I mean, this is above Red Square, so we actually didn't get anywhere helpful. Um, but, you know, whatever. It does, does remind me where I am. It's where we came in. I guess we have to go back that way to get back out, is that right? Hmm. Yeah, because we need to go back to the security zone, right? Not the, uh... So right now we're in the... This is, is this the security zone or is this the unsafe zone? I don't know. Yeah, whatever, let's just take him back through the sewers. It's, it's uh, awkward, it's inconvenient, but it's slow. It's probably better than trying to take him falling off the rooftop. Um, there's the ladder. Ah! And one second thought. Where's, where's Keeper Rami? Oh. One second thought, maybe that rooftop exit is better after all. I don't know why this kind of works, it kind of doesn't. Let's find the rooftop. Hello? Bin? Teleport? Magic door? Thank you. He's going to be upset if I, uh, 
wonder if I can get him to step on a gas mine. If I, if I appear with a body, right? Problem solved. I didn't hurt myself that time. The Rami right there, we'll go there. Take poor Edmund here and make sure he in a dark corner where uh, he won't be disturbed. That'll do. Right, where do we need to bring you back? All the way to our friend at the beginning, right? Luckily I cleared the streets. It's a dead one I have to take into the inn. And the inn is going to be a problem. I mean, this part of the streets might be a problem too. Because I think there's still guards and stuff at the other end, so. At this end. Wait there for, for me, Rami, while I scout. Because I think there's going to be people here who will not be happy to see me. Gas him. He's around there somewhere. This is bloody helmet. It's not. It's not gonna let me uh, knock him out. Most of you are not, I think, threats. Oh, you're kind of all stuck in various poses. Walton, Cornelia, Lucinda. Oh no, not the thing. Dylan. I should put you all in the enormous cuddle pile, but that's a little too, too difficult. Are you actually... No, he's not even corporeal. He drank so much. He became non-physical. Okay. I have no idea how you're supposed to get up here. Carrying a body without the guard deciding to do it. To attack you on sight? Because carrying a body is an extremely suspicious thing as far as those, those scripts are concerned. Where's the way in? The window. Hey, mate. Someone else needs your help, and you're kind of standing at the table. It's a bit weird. Okay. Where to now? Find the dead keeper. Still need a ton of loot, right? God, how much more loot do I need to find? I have no idea where I would find it. 700 odd. I mean, 600 and something, but. So, this is the problem. The loot will be a problem. Well, I think most people in here are going to be upset with this, too. So, Hondry. Flash bombs now, right? Ooh, nope, still just the one. He's right here. Help, 
Someone! There's an intruder here! Oh. I'll help. Simarut. Lady Varen. Who's gonna need to do some forensic investigation? Gas. This could be bad. It got on guard, it got. You're so close to me. Porcarus and the Builder. Porcarus. Where's my flash bomb? cleaning up to do in there, but uh, that's a start, and uh, at least I have a healing potion now, right? Tibble. Yeah. Good. So I should be able to survive a few more encounters. Oh, they're almost useless, of course. He's an expert. Looks like calm down. Tell Suma that he's unconscious. Sindel. Oh, shit. Good, you got stuck on the table. I hope he's stuck on the table for good. Or for evil, whichever works better. Maybe this path actually works now. This is very much what I tried, how I tried to sneak through here the first time. Yeah. Oops. That's a difficult mantle because of such a thin edge. Well, uh, some people are behaving like nothing's happened. Sorry, ma'am. Glenn. And I'll lose the rope there. But now... Oh. 
Some of you people are not bothered. But I need to be thorough here. Vanessa? Stain? Well, there's another guy in here who's. Hmm. This may not work. Well, let's just hope keeping the door shut is good. Sean? And Kyoto. Pierce. A lot of people here. Hmm. It's not quite dark enough for my liking. Check some more names. Carl. Sir Durin. Sir Doyle. Are you Lady What's Her Name? Lady Melonia. Oh, I guess you're sleeping on the sofa, but you know what? Sleep on your diary. Okay. We've almost finished cleaning up here in the inn. come from. You're not going to escape my clutches. What are you running away to? There's nobody here to help you. Why are you running as fast as I can run? That's not fair. Uh. Well, would you look at that? Oh, no, Ash. You walk right into the cuddle pile. Laura can join you there. This is... I mean, this is quite ridiculous. Knocking everybody out is definitely not what I'd normally try and do, but, uh... And all the civilians don't really matter, but, uh... The rest of them kind of do. I'm a little concerned about the guy on the table, because he might get back down. But unless he gets really upset, he's so surprised he's going to be stuck there. Kind of. Simon, okay. Kind of want to see what his friend's name is too, but... Paolo. This Q, of course, you're the owner. Oh, you were doing a spice deal, that's right. Are you now? But you won't be so cheery when my friends arrive. You know what? I'm gonna spend another one of these. Okay. I'll see well, I'm gonna end the episode here. It's a lot longer than I planned, Just but uh, uh this is embarrassing. It is kind of embarrassing. Um you're stuck on a table, unable to attack. Fight me, you coward. So, uh, see you for the next episode shortly.